All right. Uh, let's start from the top. All right, I've been having gaps in between. Um, been having gaps in between right now of content because I had a little something something to happen. Never happened to me before, but it was bound to happen because of the situation. So, situation is, yeah, my car got robbed. I got jacked, you know, a little bit. You know, I ain't gonna say I got jacked. I still have my car, but it got broken into and they tried to, you know, try to get away with it, but didn't happen for some reason, and, you know. I still have the car, but it's just the whole fact that I got a busted window and, you know, and all that stuff in between. But my thing is, my thing is, all this mess is stemming off of TikTok. So my car that I had, I had a Hyundai and I had the Hyundai and the whole thing about it is everybody kept following this stupid ass TikTok about them doing this with the USB cable. You can drive off with the car. It's like y'all, y'all people, y'all to get on my nerves doing this stuff. Seriously. And it's like I already was like irritated when I was hearing about it. Oh, they sweeping around. They doing this to people. I'm like. Please just stop with the BS, yo. Seriously, why y'all got to sit up there and take somebody's shit? You know, just because it's real easy to do, and then turn around. Oh, it's on TikTok. I, I wish a dumbass would come up and tell me. Oh, or I would see one on in that time. I said, oh, TikTok made me do it, man. Please get out of here with that, man. Man, stop stealing people's shit. Stop trying to bust in people's shit. You know, it's not it's not cool. It's never cool. Do what I'm doing. <laughs> Move some boxes or something. You know, I mean, that's all you have to do. You don't have to sit up there and go around and try and bust in somebody's stuff and take it. I didn't even have anything in the car. They just wanted the car. And it's stupid. They do it for stupid reasons. It's just get on my nerves. So... Just want to give y'all a PSA, you know, uh, announcement of why, you know, I've been MIA for probably like a day or two is because I'm dealing with this right now, but it's not going to stop me from doing what I need to do as far as like a content creator. I'm still going to keep it pushed. I'm still going to keep it moving. Luckily, I can secure that type of, you know, I can secure that because of the job I'm in, but some people don't have that don't have that set up so like i said stop breaking into people's stuff you don't know what everybody's li living situation is it's probably it's probably most likely different from mine probably sitting up here don't even have the stuff or the resources to sit up there and keep it pushing but they still do it anyway not not having no disregard or anything like that like somewhere like do it does it ever go through your mind that you just feel like oh you feel bad about doing it probably don't you probably don't care. But either way, stop trying to break into somebody's stuff, yo. Seriously. And, and this TikTok, this dumb stuff being on TikTok, it just got out of hand. I can post positivity on my stuff. Never get seen, never get heard. But everybody and they mama and little boys, little girls and everything like that, all that stuff, negative stuff, including the stuff about the... You know how easy it is to get the you know get the cars and stuff like that. They'll watch that all day over and over until they get it glued in the head, and it's stupid. So, like I said, all those who got the Kia and the Hyundai, they need to you know be aware of what's going on and take precautions and stuff because this shit got out of hand. And you know, I, I feel for those who are in in Michigan and a few other states that had it the worst the most. So. The area I'm staying in is it's about there too. It's just it's just stupid. They just do it for stupid reasons. You know, and I'm pretty sure there's not even nothing positive out of it. So like I said, I'm gonna keep my head up, I'm gonna keep it pushing. 
You know, it's like a whole lot of it's like a whole lot of stuff that came up in a matter of days. First, I find out, you know, had death in the family. Then this happens, you know, and stuff like that. So yeah, it just it just depends. You know, it just depends on how you take it. So I'm I'm in good spirits. I'm okay. Everything is good. The only thing that's is bad is just the freaking car. You know, I didn't really worry about it. You know, I'm moving forward. I just want to throw that out there and just be like, hey, people, y'all stop stealing people other stuff, yo. Y'all just do not care. And this, I mean, making it hard is not life is already gonna be hard. But then you making it harder on yourself when you find out that you've been caught or you've been, you know, it, it just just don't make any sense. So, other than that, spreading positive positivity amongst people giving y'all a PSA you know and you know just keeping y'all up to date about what's going on on my end and why you know everything had kind of stopped for like a day or two or whatever that's the reason why I'm dealing with that but I will continue on like continue on running these numbers up and we're going to go ahead and move forward now we done got that out of the way but other than that if you watch this all the way through, I appreciate you for watching. If you haven't, you know, and you don't, and you haven't got to this point, I mean, eventually it's only a matter of time for you to come over to, you know, come over to the crew. So make sure you like, comment, you know, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to have more stuff coming up, you know, back to the daily grind like we usually do and stuff. So, you know, just want to let y'all know that. But I'm out here. About to go ahead and bust this workout and get back to it. Other than that, I will see y'all in the next video. Peace. Stay safe and just think positive, man. All you can do. I'm out this thing. Peace.